The largest cruise ship in the world is almost ready. A ship that is expected to be the largest cruise ship in the world has finished construction at a Finnish shipyard and made its maiden journey into open water for sea trials before it is slated to be delivered in October of this year. Icon of the Seas, a massive cruise ship from Royal Caribbean International, will measure 365 meters long or almost 1,200 feet and weigh an estimated 250,800 tons. In January 2024, it will cruise into Caribbean waters with a capacity of 5,610 passengers and 2,350 staff members. The largest water park at sea in the world will be the boat's showpiece. The vessel, Category 6, will include six water slides that will set records, but those who want a more sedate experience can unwind in one of the vessel's seven pools or nine whirlpools. It is being constructed in Turku, Finland, at Meyer Turku Shipyard, one of the top shipyards in Europe. Before its 2024 debut, Royal Caribbean International President and Chief Executive Michael Bailey informed the public at an on-site news conference earlier this year that the ship was scheduled to join the company's fleet on October 26. Another ship in the Royal Caribbean line, Wonder of the Seas, which took its first voyage only last year and is a somewhat shorter 1,188 feet long with just 18 decks to explore, now holds the title of most giant cruise ship in the world. We are positioning it as the ultimate family vacation and when you step back and look at all the energy and time that has gone into creating this ship, it is mind-blowing," Bailey said. The Icon completed its first set of sea trials on June 22, according to a Royal Caribbean statement. During her first set of sea trials, Icon of the Seas traveled hundreds of miles, during which the main engines, hull, brake systems, steering, noise, and vibration levels were all tested, the statement said. More than 40 dining, drinking, and entertainment options are advertised by the ship, many of which are included in the cruise cost. The concept is to appeal to every sort of vacationer, with everything from locations for young children to adults-only spots like Royal Caribbean International's first dueling pianos bar. There are 20 decks and 8 districts to explore. There are 28 distinct varieties of lodging, with more options for families, more designs with views of the ocean, and more room for groups. According to the cruise line, this is the most time ever devoted to designing the ideal home base. As part of the company's transition to a clean energy future, Icon of the Seas is also Royal Caribbean International's first ship propelled by liquefied natural gas, LNG, and fuel cell technology. On Icon of the Seas, over 2,600 employees have been hard at work every day. During the four-day sea testing, there were hundreds of experts on board to evaluate performance. A second round of sea testing, according to Royal Caribbean, is planned for later in 2023. All year long, Icon of the Seas departs from Miami on seven-night cruises to the Eastern and Western Caribbean. Every sailing will include a visit to Perfect Day at Coco Cay. Royal Caribbean's award-winning private island destination, as well as its new expansion, Hideaway Beach.